All right, folks, Sunday. It's about 5 o'clock. I just finished evening chores. I got a few minutes uh, to kill here for a little bit, uh, and then I have to go to the Mother's Day celebration that we're having. Figured this would be a great time to uh, give you an update on these uh, Holstein heifer calves that are doing absolutely fantastic, and they're growing like weeds. <coughs> Excuse me, it's not going to be any more than about 27 days or so. These first two will be ready to weaned off. <coughs> Excuse me. Healthy as can be. Um, I have not had to do, knock on wood, one ounce of what I'm going to call doctoring or care. Nothing. That's, uh, that's a pat on the back to the dairy that I'm getting these from. Uh, between some of the shots and whatnot that they administer. And, uh, you know, they, they get a lot of TLC there that first couple few days or so. And then when it comes down to it, I'm not even allowed to take these calves off the farm till about day number four or five. Uh, very honorable ordeal. This has just been going fantastic. I'll do a video later to come, not right now, and I will share with you my mad science, which there's nothing mad about it, of uh, the process of taking care of these girls, uh, uh, milk replacement rations, uh, how many times a day, what am I using, and everything else. Uh, I will go ahead and tell you, I spoke with the, uh, the dairyman, it's no more than about two or three days ago, and I committed, <laughs> I committed to grab 10 more of them starting about June 15th-ish. Uh, why not? Why not? I've got the hutches, I dare say time. Uh, According to the markets and speculation and everything else and how they are now and where they're supposed to be in futures If I was a smart man, I'd be raising two rounds of 50, but that's not reality um, I will be getting 10 more though. These will all be fully weaned off before I do so Quite naturally this uh, this yard picked up and cleaned up able to be dried out for a little while disinfect the inside of the hutches i do do that they're doing great uh, they're eating like pigs they're uh their country calf ration these first four right here they're going through a full pail about every uh bless you that almost sounded human. Full pail about every four days. I just filled them again. You can see she's getting a big nice bite to eat to that country calf. And that's basically, it, it, it's, like, it's like Purina Spartina, but it's not as molasses-y. Pretty nice weather here lately, so of course the open uh, the open vents for some air, and uh, it's usually and it depends on rain. Rain rain will make a big mess. Usually it's once a week. I take about three bales of straw out here, and everybody gets some fresh bedding, fresh bedding without cleaning the hutches. The hutches will not get completely cleaned until wean off. There's no need for that. So they're doing real good. Very happy with this. Uh, all we can do is hope and pray that the, uh, the next 10 that come in are as smooth as these. Just another little avenue at a very small scale, but an avenue nonetheless. tell you right now if this dairy industry goes to where it's speculated to do so and I hope it does those dairy boys need a break 
everybody in ag needs a break. Those dairy boys more than anything. Men and women, excuse me. Um, where was I going with this? Yeah, these are these are going to be worth a mint if it goes where it's speculated to go. Now, of course, there's a lengthy investment here, uh, roughly about 20 to 21 months. It's a long time, folks. There's an expense that goes with it, obviously. And of course, the goal here, if you don't know what I'm doing, the goal is to sell these off as what's called springers. That means that they will be bred heifers, about seven months bred, obviously a couple months away from uh, from calving, uh, and that is the time that they are to be sold. <sighs> Pretty happy, doing real good. That's all I got. I got a couple chores to do. I need to get cleaned up and uh, go uh, celebrate Mother's Day. Go from there. Hope everybody's doing okay. Really do. Tomorrow's Monday. Put that best foot forward the best you can. That goes for me too. Watch the attitude. That goes for me too. Yeah. See what we can do. Lean forward. Keep working. That's it. Talk to you sooner and later.